Amrita Dash and I welcome you back to Odisha Day. Here are today's top news headlines. The Odisha Electricity Regulatory Commission on Thursday announced that the domestic and commercial electricity tariffs will remain unchanged in the state. The per unit charge will remain unchanged at rupees 3 for the first 50 units. In the 50 to 200 unit slab, the rate will be rupees 4 per unit. From 200 to 400 units, consumers will be charged rupees 5.8 per unit, while consumption above 400 units will be charged rupees 6.20 per unit. According to OERC Secretary Priyabrat Patnaik, the delayed payment surcharge for domestic consumers have been waived off. The penalty levied after the rebate date will not be charged. The rural consumers will get 10 paisa per unit rebate. West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee met Odisha Chief Minister Naveen Patnaik at Naveen Nivas in Bhubaneswar. Chief Minister Naveen Patnaik welcomed CM Mamta Banerjee with presenting an Anga Vastra of Mahaprabhu and replica of the three chariots. CM Naveen Patnaik also presented to the West Bengal CM a filigree work and Chenapura. The West Bengal CM presented a shawl to Odisha CM specially prepared by Biswa Bangla. She also paid respect to Biju Babu and Gyana Patnaik by presenting a Jamdani Sari. Following the meeting, CM Naveen Patnaik said, Today was a courtesy call. There was no in-depth discussion on serious political matters. We just said that the federal structure in India should remain permanent and strong. The Odisha government began drunk driving checks in the state from today. The three-day intensive checking to prevent incidents of drunken driving will be conducted from 3 p.m. to 12 a.m. The violators will be fined and sent to jail. The decision has been taken by the State Transport Department as per the direction of the centre. An elephant has reportedly been killed and its tusks removed at Kuldeha Wildlife Sanctuary in Balasore district. The special squad of Commissionerate Police busted an interstate gang of looters in Bhubaneswar. Three looters, all residents of Tamil Nadu, have been arrested. Other members of the gang managed to flee. That's all for today. Thank you for watching Orissa